Hi, I'm Mandeep Singh, founder of Mandeeps.com and in this video we'll learn how to import a page template from for one of Mandeep's DNN themes in DNN 7 or 8. So let's get started. What I have here is uh, an instance of DNN 8 uh, on which I've already installed our Tahoe theme and we've, we've imported a portal template to create a sample site. Now even though we're working with Tahoe, this video applies to any of Mandeeps.com DNN themes. So you can follow it along for a portal and a, or any other theme that we offer. So let's get started. One of the first things you want to do to import a page template is to identify the page you want to import. Now, uh, for our demo, I'm just going to go ahead and let's say, uh, let's see, we'll choose, okay. Uh, let's say I want to create this pricing tables page and uh, let's say I didn't have a sample site, the complete sample site, or I just, I've deleted the page or now I need to just import that one page in. That's very easy to do. Uh, the first thing we want to do is locate the page template itself and that is in the downloads. So uh, the theme package that you downloaded from DNN store or mandeeps.com is, uh, is a zip file that has the word extract me in it. Make sure you unzip or extract that zip file and inside you see a folder structure that looks like this. We want to go to the templates folder and to the pages folder and then specifically look for the page we we're trying to import. In this case it would be the pricing tables dot page dot template. All right, so now that I know which page template I want to import, we can get going. Make sure you're logged in as an admin or as a super user or someone who has the privileges and then navigate to admin file management. You want to make sure that the uh, template that you want to import exists in this templates folder. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and upload it in really quick and simply drag and drop or browse to it. I'll just drag this here and in my side it says it already exists so I'm just going to go ahead and say replace it either way. So now that we've imported or uh, uploaded the template to our site we can now go ahead and create a new page using that template. So let's see how to do that. Alright we're going to pages and we're going to say add new page and we'll give it a name. I'll just call it pricing tables and then I want uh, let's see, no parent page, I just want it to be created uh, in the root menu, include in menu. Most important here is we choose the template folder. This is by default template, so we can leave it there. And then we choose the page template. Now this would be the pricing tables file we just imported in. And that would be this one right here. We simply click on add page. Now if we've done everything correctly, we should have a new pricing tables uh, page right here and the page is already created for us and it's an identical copy of what we see right here. There we go. That's it for this short video. If you have any questions or concerns, if there's anything I missed, feel free to open a support ticket and we'll be happy to assist you. Thank you so much for watching the video.